will see you in a few minutes. So does your car look like this minivan? Still got snow piled on the roof? Well, if you're guilty of it, Chris Davis has a few reasons why the extra effort to clean it is worth your time, Chris. Well, Mike, it's not technically illegal to have snow like this still on your vehicle, but Missouri Highway Patrol says, put it this way, if some snow launches off your vehicle and causes an accident, you could end up footing the bill. At first glance, it seems harmless. What could a little snow on your car do to hurt someone else? Our own Jen Sullivan has a whole new perspective. This is what's left of her windshield when a giant chunk of ice flew off another vehicle that was on I-64 and nearly shattered her front windshield. Thankfully, she's okay, but knows it could have been so much worse. And that driver wasn't the only culprit. We drove all around St. Louis, both on city streets and on the interstate, and found numerous examples of snow-covered cars. We ended up following this minivan for several miles on I-70 West. It's hard to tell in the video, but several chunks of ice and snow dislodged and nearly hit our own car. You all noticed it too. Someone posted a picture on Facebook of this Wentzville school bus that was still covered in snow. So we went to check it out at the bus yard and we found dozens of buses were still covered in snow. A spokesperson for the school district tells us the transportation department simply didn't have enough time to clean all the buses before they hit the road this week. They say they are working on it, but haven't figured out a quick way to get all the buses road ready for picking up students. So here's one other reason to also clear it off. Highway Patrol says, let's say you get into an accident and you happen to have snow like this still on your car, just because of that, you might be deemed at fault. So I'm gonna follow my own advice and clear off my truck here and Mike and in. I don't know what your vehicles look like. You probably have garages to park it in, but uh, I can shovel <laughs> yours too while I'm out here. Well, it sounds like a good idea. Chris in downtown St. Louis tonight, thank you.